I'd like to call to order the Douglas Zoning Board of Appeals meeting for Wednesday, September 9th at 7.12 p.m. <laughs> um, I think we're just going to do things out of order a little bit. Why don't we um, take up the McIntyre materials um, issue first, discussion. Um, I don't know if everybody's aware, but there was a, just a, um, when the decision was written, there was a minor mistake there. It referred to a setback for a sideline versus a frontage um, uh, variant. So it was retyped. And, um, and I, I don't know, do you have anything to add to that, Brian? I don't, do we need to revote? No, just that, um, uh, you know, I looked back at it, uh, the, the uh, scrutiny there, as we call it, my mistake, uh, was pointed out. I looked back and sure enough there it was. So I had referred to one of the three types of relief that was, uh, was sought as a front setback variance when in fact it was a front end variance. So what I set out this afternoon was sort of a collected version, um, just changed the terminology. Uh, there's no substantive change to the decision whatsoever, so I think it's just an administrative, you know, change to make it conform to your vote. Um, my original draft did not, so I think you can just uh, vote to adopt uh, the decision as corrected, and I titled it a corrected decision, uh, and then you can just process it in the regular course from there. Okay. All right. Um, I'll move that we accept the decision as corrected. Second. Okay, we have a motion by Mrs. Holmes, seconded by Mr. Fitzpatrick to approve the corrected decision for McIntyre materials. All in favor? Aye. 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 I think because we're online. So, aye, Dan Heaney. Pam Holmes, aye. Fitzpatrick, aye. Pumbara, aye. Okay, so we'll get this signed, uh, Mr. McIntyre, and we'll, we'll get it to you uh, ASAP. Thank you, and uh, just one quick question. I don't know if I'll be back in the future, but would the board prefer next time if, if I do have a petition to draft proposed findings? Um, or is that something that th this town, this board doesn't typically do? Uh, I'm sorry, I missed the question. I didn't hear it. We do do findings, right, Mr. Winner? Attorney Winner? Sure, I usually draft them up um, based on the minutes and the application materials, et cetera, but it's, it's up to the board and the chair. Um, you know, I'm always happy to look at proposals and suggestions. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll absorb, I'll review, I'll reflect. Um, but at the end of the day, uh, I suppose you can ask the, the chair and the board members, and if they invite you to do so, I have no objection. Okay. Mm -hmm. No so, worries. I just uh, it's whatever makes it easier for the board and for Okay. Sounds good. Right. Very right. good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So we're going to pass those around. We'll get them signed. We'll get them to Bill, and then sure. we can move on to the next. Wow, there are actually people online. Yeah. Good thing I got. <laughs> we make those little tiptoe noises when we come in. I know, right? Give them that right. Pam, if you could sign those and give them the bill after, sure. that'd be great. <laughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I figured there was no sense in him waiting on mine. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that would be cool. Thank you, Pam. Okay, the next agenda item is the uh, continued public hearing for Rebecca Laramie, case number 2020-04, 17 Huff Road. Would you like to join us? I brought Barry along because I don't understand what you guys talk about, so instead of continuously going back and forth, I just figured... Yep. Yeah, please yep. do. Just move, move them apart so that yeah, they're not sitting on top of another. I can sit back here. No, you can sit up there. 
Thank you. So accommodating, isn't he? That guy, Mike? Is he like that at home? What's that? So accommodating. Oh, sorry. Yeah, sure you are. And if you could just um, introduce yourself so that the minute taken knows who you are. Uh, my name is Barry Badrack, and I represent Ms. Laramie. Okay, great. Okay, I look forward to you. Should we introduce your... ourselves, too? Maybe? Oh, sure, yep. This is Mrs. Sam Holmes. Sam Holmes, yep. uh, on, the, on the zoning board. Tan Heaney. Mike Fitzpatrick. John Bambara. Yep. So, the floor is yours. Okay. Can yeah. I just ask a question? So we only have four? Right. Okay. So does that make it, like, before? I remember. I, I had, yeah. like, a heart attack right. when we, like, two last four right. was something bad. Well, no, you need no. all four votes. Uh, we have vote another vote. member who, who hasn't showed up tonight. And, and last time you gave him the opportunity to have a continuance? Correct. And do we have that opportunity tonight? If you'd like. Sure. Should we talk this for a second? So, yes, just to put it in perspective, mm -hmm. um, everyone here has been at every right. one of these meetings so right. far. Yes. The one person who has not is Lou Ticino, correct? He was at the last meeting. He was at, he was at all of them. Lou right? was at all of them. At all of them. Mm -hmm. Correct. But Sean was not, mm -hmm. and, and Ron uh, was not. Right. Yeah, I, 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 miss, well, I just told the, the yeah. chairman that I watched the whole meeting oh, okay. uh, before I got here. But I, I, yeah, I yeah. Just yeah. Yeah. yeah, so yeah. our other voting member tonight would have been Lou because he participated. Would have been Lou, so there's one person that participated throughout the whole process that is not here tonight. Correct. So if, if can he uh, watch it and then have He can. We, we've adopted the Mullen rule. He has the ability to do that. Like I did, but, I, I watched but if it. You if they watch it. I missed it. Clearly, if you wanted to so vote tonight, so I watched the whole meeting so I can still participate. The vote because of this four, the four. Well, that's up to so, the board mm -hmm. and you. And so he could watch it, and then we wouldn't take any vote tonight. We wait for him. We can we can continue it, uh, or we can close the close the here the public hearing, and then wait until next month to to, vote. to, to, to do the uh, yep. decision hearing. Yep. Uh, why don't you? Uh, just Dan, take a second. Dan, okay. Dan. Yeah. Brian. Yeah. Oh, oh, Brian. I'm sorry, I don't know how to introduce Jack. I just wanted to raise one point, and that's that the moment rule only works once. So if there's any chance that um, Mr. Sino is not going to meet the next meeting, then you're back down to four whether or not you continue it. So if he misses tonight, fine. Um, and if he shows up at the next one, you can mull in, but you can only miss one meeting. Oh, it's one meeting. Okay. That's okay. good to know. Thank you. Yep, great. Thank you. Maybe you want to make Okay. Maybe you want to make your announcement. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Um, first of all, um, Ron Forge was appointed an alternate CBA member. He's not here tonight, but he mm -hmm. is our new alternate. Um, mm -hmm. Mike Fitzpatrick and I were reappointed um, to the board for three-year terms. And um, Mary Wright, who's done our minutes since 2012, um, has moved on. So I just wanted to thank Mary for the good work that she's done over the years, and uh, she's, she's gonna be missed. Yeah. And our new minute taker's name is Ashley Pones, and uh, we look forward to working with her in the future. I haven't met Ashley yet, but um, I'm sure Ashley's going to do a great job. Yes. As gonna, Mary did. Yes. yes. You know, more about town vocabulary than uh, you ever wanted to. <laughs> Dan, I, uh, when, she, you know, when Rebecca comes back, I think what she was asking was if she could have the meeting and then when next month, then you vote on it. So mm -hmm. I think she's a little confused on that. I don't know if he's going to explain why, that to her. Yeah, that's why I, I don't think we, go out, yeah. we would necessarily go to a meeting and then, okay, now you can wait. Yeah. Right. right. I don't know. I mean, if they want. Well, I mean, this has been going on for quite a while, so it, I think it's no, to her benefit that, that things that things move on and we yeah. you know, come to no, some. No, absolutely. Yeah. <clears throat> 
I mean, if I just we have enough sure members. She wasn't confused as to what yeah. she could do. It. But we do have enough members to vote, so I, sure. I don't know yeah. what the need is to wait a month. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, that's fine. You do. Where are you at with the time frame, though, isn't it? No, it's actually from the um, um, 90 days after the close of the public hearing. Right. Oh, okay. So as long as it gets continued, it and we could we could leave it open too. We we'll close it we next could. month. Right. We don't have to close it tonight. Mm -hmm. I mean, if what's, what's the decision timeline on this, Brian? Oh, it's 90 days from the close of the public hearing. From the close? Yeah. It can be remain yeah, open. Normally, it would be from the day that you close it, but we're still under the state of emergency special act. Oh. Um, so technically, there are no deadlines passing right. anymore. Good. Thank you. I would say if they're continuing, they could just wait till next month, make their own presentation, and if he has any questions, he can answer. That's correct. He can answer them. Okay. Right. Hi. We're here, so we'd like to proceed. Uh, what we'd like to do is present our evidence and answer your questions and concerns and but then close the hearing and continue it to a vote when yeah. you have to give you a chance to review it and participate? Yeah. Um, I, I don't think that's a good idea. The only reason is um, if he has questions and we close yeah. the public hearing, he can't ask you any questions. Yeah. And so the, the other thing, um, Mr. Winner had said that he's only allowed to miss one meeting. So in the event that he doesn't come next, mm -hmm. back to then, yeah. he, then his vote can count. Correct, Brian? That's right. Yeah. Yeah. If he, what we're saying is if we continue it tonight and he can't make the next meeting, then we're, we're back to he's, this. He's our, we're your going. four votes. That's what yeah, you're left with. Yeah, nothing changes. That's afterwards. what you're left with. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It's always four. You need four. Four no, plus. Normally we have five on a regular. This is okay. kind of so you crazy. have five, but you need four. Mm -hmm. need, need four to, <coughs> to go in your favor. Okay. All four. Okay. Oh, it's getting dark out earlier. Right? It happens every night. <laughs> it's, I don't like the It's early. just nonstop. It is. Oh, you guys. She taught me. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we'd like to move to continue. Okay, so you're requesting continuance? Yes, please. Okay. So. October 14th at 7. Okay. So. Hi. Actually, I'm sorry. Uh, 7.15 if you want to reorg. Okay. Um, I won't be in Massachusetts on Saturday. Okay. So we will be nice. Sweet. You going somewhere? You mean hope so? <laughs> well, it's so cold. It's really kind of cold. Yeah. Well, of course. Right. Of course. Of course. So we're getting, we're getting out of Florida. November 12th, yeah. 7 o'clock. Okay. <clears throat> so the applicants requested a hmm. continuance to November 11th, 7 p.m. Uh, 12. No, I'm no. sorry. I'm um, 12. That's that's a Thursday. Is that right? No, it can't be. November 12th. No. Second, second, second Wednesday, Wednesday of the month. It's the 11th. That's the 11th. It's the 11th. He has he has you on Thursday. I don't know. 11, 11. I apologize. No, I'm glad you brought it up because I would have been like, hey, 11, 11, unless there's something going on, she didn't write down. Who's on yeah. first? Can so, I um, just ask you guys, you received the packet, is everything in there that you asked for from last time? Is there anything else you needed? Well, do you want to move really forward tonight or do you want to wait? You don't want to. Okay. You can't, you can't, you can't right. ask questions unless we open it. Then right. Yeah. Open it. Correct. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we, the applicants hey, requested it. Bill, Someone make a move. The 11th is Veterans Day. Uh, That's why. why. November Thank 11th. you, Mark. Thank you, Mark. Thank you. 11 11. So back to the 12th. I guess you guys had advertised on the 12th because she has it written on the 12th. Yeah. She usually goes through it. Yeah. does look at the. 
see, see if there's anything that okay. so it's a 12th. It, yep it's a continuous <laughs> catastrophic till november failure. 12th november at 7 15 pm mm. we have a motion motion to grant the continuance yeah. motion to grant the continuance second so we have a motion by mr fitzpatrick seconded by mr bombara all in favor aye, aye. aye. okay we'll see you on uh, 11 12. Sorry about that. You need okay. a roll call. Yeah, we do uh, need a roll call. I, Dan Heaney. You can home side. side. Good job, Thank Bob. I. Thank you. Have a great day. Okay, you too. Okay. Anything else for Brian? No, I don't no. think so. Thank you, Brian. Thank you, Brian. Brian, one thing, you know, fix that squeaky chain you got. We, uh, good to see you. Invoice. <laughs> Thank you. See you soon. Meeting minutes? Yeah. And we have an invoice here that needs to be signed. So we're looking to review the minutes of the June 10th meeting. Sure thing. July 8th and August. You can have mine every time. Can you pass that to Thank you. Thank you. I'll move that we accept the minutes. No, can I ask a question before sure. you do that? Go right ahead. Um, only August 12th is the only one that we're all here. Louie was here at the other two. Should we be uh, doing those? Yeah, we probably should. Hmm? Louie was here on July 8th and June 10th for the minutes. Yeah. This uh, August 12th is the only one that it was the four of us. Doesn't really matter. No? Yeah, I guess the majority is only the. Right, and, and you, you actually. I, I know that it, uh, the Board of Selectmen, I mean, I, I'm sure that you can vote even if you weren't there. Mm -hmm. You have to get your minutes approved. Okay. So you can even, yeah, I mean, it might not be a good idea if you make the motion, but uh, right. somebody was That's there. That's why I've always I never make the motion, not the persons that were there, because I could. Okay, yeah. yeah, but you can vote and say aye. Aye, yep. Uh, so anyway, I'll start again. I'll move that we approve the minutes of June 10th as written. Okay, we have a motion by Mrs. Holmes. Do we have a second? Second. Seconded by Mr. Fitzpatrick. All in favor of approving the minutes of June 10th as written? Say aye. 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 Okay. Do we need to do the same for the minutes? Yeah. Aye, Dan Heaney. Aye, Pam Holmes. Aye, John Obama. Fitzpatrick, I just make sure you were done. Okay. Step in the middle of your Okay. And we have the, That's what I did, the minutes of yeah. July 8th. Make a motion to approve the minutes of July 8th. Second. Okay, we have a motion by Mr. Fitzpatrick, seconded by Mrs. Holmes to approve the minutes of July 8th as written. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Abstained. Pam Holmes. Thank you, John, you're abstained? Yep. Okay. <coughs> I did Pam Holmes, aye. Dan Heaney, aye. Fitzpatrick, aye. John Malone, abstained. Abstained. Okay. Okay, John, your turn. What? You were here. The next one. I'll go. Oh, okay. The next Come on. one. Yeah. Come on. August. Uh, let me see. August 12th. Uh, make the motion we approve the uh, minutes for August 12th, 2000, uh, 2020. Second. Okay. We have a motion by Mr. Bombara, seconded by Mrs. Holmes, to approve the minutes of August 12th as written. All in favor? Aye. 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 Pam Holmes, aye. Dan Heaney, aye. Fitzpatrick, aye. Umbara, aye. Okay. 
Okay. Anything else on our agenda? Future. Yeah. And that is uh, everything that we had on our agenda. Anything so. new, old, or un or un unanticipated? <laughs> Not that I'm aware of. We'll entertain a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. Okay, we have a motion by Mr. Bombara, seconded by Mrs. Holmes to adjourn. All in favor? Aye. 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 Meeting's adjourned at 7.30 p.m.